welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Spyro the Dragon. If you guys missed the last episode, Dreamweavers is done. And you guys told me that we beat the final boss of the game. Well, sort of. Wait, apparently, the last flying level that we did, the Icy Flight, is the last flying level in the game. So as far as I'm concerned, that's the final well boss. Well Spyro. I hope you know what lies in store for you. Not a clue! Nasty's world is not the friendliest place you'll ever find. Why not? Are you ready to go? Hell yeah, sounds incredible, dude. I said, wait, Need I said yes. Did I not say yes? Go to Nasty. Go to go to Ganasty. Let's go to Ganasty's world. Take me there. By the way, our gem count, 10, 500. It's just nice to see a big number. I don't know. Oh, fuck. Is that Ganasty's world in the distance? Yep. Yes, it is. I don't like it! There's only two- wait, what? There's only two dragons and 200 gems. Um... Is Nasty's world- is Nasty's world small? Like, is this- is this the finale? <laughs> wait, hold on. No, 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 shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! Stay here! I- <laughs> Okay. I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed! Is this man gonna try to talk to me even if I like, like that's, okay, hey, no, 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 I just wanna stay here, thank you, bye, bye, I gotta, I gotta go, I gotta go, I'm gonna talk to this little draggy, draggy, how you doing, Delbin, Delbin, my boy, <laughs> what are you looking hey, at? Hey, didn't I already free you? You're in Nasty's world now, Spyro, and you are the dragon that must defeat him. Bring him on, I'm ready. Reach the uh, exit in each of Nasty's lands. Then you can challenge the Nork himself. Okay, but you didn't answer the question. Didn't I already free you? I don't necessarily remember, but like I guarantee that the game would have thrown that in there just for funsies. Uh, okay. You guys were also telling me that I have to actually go through the level exit of every world. Um, I have to make sure that I don't just, you know, exit through the menu. Um, now I'm not sure if that's, that's, uh, that's for every single world in the past, or if it's just these, because it sounds like from what that guy just said, yeah, I have to do it for just these. Okay, let's go to Nort Cove, I guess, because I see no other option. It's a little weird, because typically I try my damnedest to, to fucking get all of the gems and the dragons and complete the overworld before I go into the individual levels, but I don't think that's an option. So here I go to, to, to Nort Cove. <laughs> Why is it just now that I'm pronouncing the silent G? Who the fuck's to say? Oh, shit! Yeah, is that Ganork Cove I see? Yeah, this is actually- Donkey Kong, you son of a bitch! <laughs> Don't be such an asshole. What are we dealing with? 400 gems, two dragons. There's not a whole lot going on here, is there? In Ganork Cove. I'm really surprised I managed to maintain my entire life. My entire life? Maintained. Also, that was fun. I like that. Can I do that to this? I guarantee I can't do that to that. Like, I, I kind of want to try to ram the our already moving barrel, you know what I'm saying? Just fuck the moving barrel right up with my fucking face. TNT, hey, that sounds fun. <laughs> I didn't know how far I should have gotten away. So we're dealing with TNT, dynamite. Hey, that's kind of cool. I like it. And fuck you. <gasps> okay. I said fuck you. <laughs> I like just nudging him a little bit. Give him a little nudge. Give him a little nudge. Yeah. I like it. I like the whole exploding barrel motif that I see so far. What's this place even called? Nort Cove. I already know this. I said it like a thousand times dumbly. I should already... <gasps> what the fuck? I'm just gonna hope that's not an omen for things to come in this world for me because, uh, yikes, yikes, yikes on bikes. Excuse moi, sir. Yeah, you're gonna have to perish as well. Where was I? It was this, right? This is what I was trying to get to? Not even? Uh, excuse me. Okay. Uh, -oh. can I jump on this? Is that okay? Boop. Ah, God! Oh, it's a little slippery. It's a little slippery. Don't know how I feel about that. I might actually have to climb up on this. Seems likely. And I go. And a touchdown, baby. That's how it fucking the work. <laughs> I don't know where this awful exit is coming from. 
but here I am. Hey, how you doing? You like this? <laughs> I'm gonna guess not. I'm gonna guess not. <laughs> oh, it's funny because Nork. Okay, uh, 58 gems, a total of 400. Yes, I already forgot. Fucking goddamn it. Um, okay, can I get over there? Can I get over there? You know what? It's been a long time since I seen one of them thief, one of them thieving bastards, one of them thievy boys. <sighs> oh god! Oh yeah, so funny, isn't it? You're holding fucking TNT, you dumb shit. How you feel? Oh my god, oh my god, stop, stop, stop. He didn't even have armor, so it was real easy to fucking stop his shit. And I'm gonna need that too. Can't leave a single gem behind. Don't let a single one get away, says Fox McCloud. <laughs> oh my god, Bracer. Dude, dude, it's simple. You just gotta Donkey Kong this shit. Stop, stop, you're such a bastard today. And these are mine. Is this the second dragon in this world? Is this the first? Latif? Queen Latif? Wait, what? No, I definitely already said that before. Keep What's up happening? The good work, Spyro. I expect Nasty's really starting to worry about you. I'd be shaking in my Nork boots if I were him. Uh huh. <laughs> I'd be shaking right in him, my Gucci's. Gucci's? What? <laughs> are they even? Are they even? Are they even shoes? I don't even fucking know. Who even am I anymore? Can I? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like if I want to get over there, I gotta do one of these. Oh shit! And then I gotta. Damn, son! You like that shit? Oh god. Okay, I just want that. I just want the yellow gem. The yellow gem. I'm not missing anything, right? Uh oh. Oh god, please just be a life piece. Is that just a life piece down there? Yeah, it's just a life piece. Oh, thank fuck. Thank you, fucking. Uh, just gotta go this way. Gotta always aim for the lower platforms because you will not make the higher ones. I, uh, I've learned some things in my day of playing Spyro the Dragon. Can I get up there? That seems like it'd be a really cool place to hide a secret, but okay. Guess we're not doing that. Also, my god, give me some of them ratties. Give me some of them ratty daddies, because goddamn Sparks was not feeling too good in the hood today, Jake. <laughs> what is going on with me today? It's fine, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. It's fine, everything's just A-OK. -okay. Got 104 days of summer vacation and school comes along just to end it. Everybody's realizing real quick that it's, in fact, not okay. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Whoa! Take a breath! Jesus fuck! Okay, what do I need here? I need one of them barrels. One of them barrels, you could- That was dumb of me. That was really not- not- not smart of me. Oh, I need that. Okay. I like this mechanic of trying to find, like, the barrel that pairs both most well with it. I like that. Sorry, it's up. What? Why'd that fling so far? I'm pretty sure it was because the guy was already in his animation of getting hit and it wasn't finished, so it didn't even register him as a hittable enemy at the time. I have no idea, I'm just theorizing. Hey, nice lava. Oh, God! <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, can I have that? Thanks. And ram these. God, I love fucking ramming shit. When it's just all in a line like that, it's so fucking satisfying. And. Eh. Look at that. What the? The hell was that? <laughs> what the hell? Are there rats in here? Ah, rats! <laughs> ah, it's a, it's a little little play on words, I guess. Can I get up here? For like no. Um, guys, you can't you can't get up there. I tried. Where's the game even gonna put me? This isn't too bad. Sorta. Of. Just gotta go down this old path again. Hang a right, this guy's back alive for some ungodly reason. Sir, please! <laughs> there. Can I get my health back? Because I already lost a piece, because I'm an idiot. Thanks. How you doing? You're dead now. This guy is also dead. He's holding TNT like a dipshit. But uh, hey, we can't all be smart. Not even me. Aw. Just made myself real sad. Self-deprecation, honestly, is healthy, because if you bring yourself down a notch, other people can't even touch you. Like, whatever. So you say, you say I fucked your mum to me. Uh, no you didn't. That's reserved for my, my father. Thank you. I don't know what I'm on about. <laughs> He's helped me! The commentary's weird and I know it is, but I don't even give a fuck. I think it's kind of floaty and fun. I want this. That's mine now. 
Excuse me. I'm gonna take this fucking green gem. Shove it straight up your tush. Uh, you trying to do this shit with the fucking steel barrel, son? Uh-uh. Not gonna allow that. Oh, you're in for a rude awakening. Ha! What? <laughs> the door frame. It keeps hitting the door frame. All right, that's fine. Just, that's fine. That was kind of fun, I like that. Excuse me, stop rubbing your tummy. You ain't gonna be able to rub your tummy in hell, bitch. Tomas, I remember you too. Okay. Wow, I never thought I'd be rescued. Again. Especially by such a little dragon. Did you uh, forget? What I mean is, I always believed in you, Spyro. You gotta believe. <laughs> What? <laughs> I don't know what that exchange was. Also, yeah, Spyro questioned it at first, but why aren't we questioning it further? Why am I fucking saving the same dragons? Is Nort going quickly enough that he's actually recapturing some of the dragons? Also, if that's true, why don't they remember me? Cause like, or is it, is that just supposed to be ironic? Because it's like, I always believed in you Spyro, but like he already forgot the last time. Like, I don't know. Also, that was kind of fun. I liked that. That was fun. I want to see more of that shit. A little chain reaction. Let's down this way. I'll light this up first off. Before I even look down the hallway, which seems like a mistake. Okay. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, see, that was not good. And you, sir. You, sir. Uh. Okay, that's not how you die. That is not how you die. Excuse me. Just take a flame, I guess. Fine. There's a fucking barrel dispenser right there. I need a key. Uh, I need, uh, nope. Wait, what? I was joking. <laughs> I thought the game would not allow that. That was definitely like a lock chest for a key, right? Um, can I have always opened those lock chests by other means? Or is this one just like the first one where it's like, nah, I guess, I guess that's fine. <laughs> guess you can do that. That's fine. Uh, yeah, you guys are fucked now. But. <laughs> I really like this level. This is fun. <laughs> Excuse me. Ah, you shouldn't have been holding that. Hey, you should have just kept standing there like a dumb shit. But here we are. I guess you're just standing there like a dumb shit. Hey, take this. Thanks. And you know what? Can you take that one too? And for your brother. Thanks. God, you guys are really helping me out by holding all these barrels with your bodies. At right as soon as they die. Can I get in? I was genuinely trying to get in that. <laughs> Walked all the way around it. What am I missing? Uh, no dragons, but still fucking some gems. Okay. All right. That's fine. We got like 32 gems to collect. 32? 32. Got 32 gems to collect, baby. I don't know where the fuck they're at. Sparks? He says they're down. Oh, yeah. Well, no shit. Uh, hello. How are you doing? What? How did I? What? Wait, how did I miss this? I guess there's like multiple paths. What am I doing now? How am I doing? How am I doing? We still need 13 gems. That's fine, Sparks. What do you say about that one, buddy old pal? Have I even gone down this way? No, I have not. Because I'm a complete an utter nutcase. Can I have all those? That's it. Okay, this world was simple. I'm out. I'll be on my way to the convenience stores of Speedway. Where's the level exit? Like over there. And I gotta get up via a thing. Okay. Is it this path? I already forget. But yeah, it's kind of weird that- No, it's definitely not that- I see the end of the tunnel and I'm still running towards it. Is it this? No, Brayson, it's not that, sweetie. You blind dumbass. Um, okay. Yeah, no, it's this one. It's just weird that the, the game is now putting like this weird other goal in it where it's like, you gotta touch the return home. Like, why? But like, okay, how's your gem total doing? Oh, shit. 1097. Aren't there 1200? It's just- are 1,000, uh, 12,000, not 1,200, sorry. Are there 12,000 gems in this game? How are we gonna get that many gems? I have no idea. Maybe we're still yet to see. Nork Cove? God, it's been fun, but I gotta Nork and get off. <laughs> uh, barely a joke. Uh, Twilight Harbor. So, Nasty's world is just this tiny, confined platform in the middle of the ocean. <laughs> All right. How many gems? 200. Is it, is it possible that they're all just actually that simple to get? Are they just kind of hidden around within this very tiny confined area? What's back there? 
How do we get back there? What? How do we get back there? Uh, is that just the thing for Nort Cove? I kind of want to fly back there, but I feel like that would be the death of me. I want to go to Twilight Harbor, but like these gems, they got to be like right here, right? Sparks, what do you say? Sparks says that way. I guess. I don't know what you're thinking, Sparks. Seems like that way is dead. You saying? Seems a little deadly, but okay. Ah, uh, in we go to not North Cove again. <laughs> in we go back to North Cove. Let's go to Twilight Harbor. Twilight Harbor sounds nice, a little inviting. I like it. If I see one vampire though, I will leave. What do you? Is the guy got a Gatling gun? Splatoon? What the fuck is going on? Hey, no, no, just stop. How about uh, two dragons, four hundred gems? Isn't that the exact same totals as last time? What? What is with these guys? They're just like ready at the fucking helm to ambush me. Nork's got some weird fucking Splatoon assholes after me now. What the? F How did that work? How did that work? How did that work on me? That guy seems incredibly easy to dodge. <laughs> Bryson. This time things will be different because I'll use my common sense and just easily evade the g Okay, stop. Stop. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you, sweetie. I could just ram those guys too. And this guy, guy killed me last time. Not gonna allow that to happen again, probably. Okay, um. <laughs> what? Okay, okay. This time, this time, seriously, things go be different, guys, because look at this. This new strategy I got is called run the fuck forward and kill him. <laughs> See, you can't kill me if you're already dead, silly. That's that's the that's the nature of the game here. That's that's called life. If you don't exist, hey, guess what? You can't kill me. In fact, you can't do anything because you're fucking dead. Well, let me just make sure that I'm not. I keep forgetting that there's a roll mechanic, and then I accidentally hit it. It's so odd. Like, I, also, I was really close to rolling off the ledge, and I didn't even know. Excuse me. No. Okay, that hurt. I need to sprint in there. I can't just casually walk up to these gents. Excuse me, sir. Would you like a delicious taste of my flame breath? You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to taste it, cause I insist. I... Okay. All right. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Everything's fine. Everything's cool. Everything's fine. Everything's cool and fine. And I'm dying. I'm actually dying still. Everything's not quite fine, and it's fine. They're all dead. I need. The, I need this exploded somehow. I need that exploded. Gotta remember that that's a thing. Can I get Sparks back up to full health? God damn, look at that. Shining like a goddamn golden firefly, because that's exactly what the fuck he is. Thank you for rescuing me. You're welcome, you son of a bitch! <laughs> dude, dude, god damn it! Oh, this motherfucking Donkey Kong ass. Hey, what up? Yeah, you're gonna need to stop throwing the barrels. Don't, 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 don't fucking appreciate that shit. Sorry, that's just gonna have to end now, you crazy bastard. And you, sir, jump over your liquid disgusting. Thanks. I kind of like the the look of the, the the splunk. The splunk? The third. Are they manufacturing green splunk? Look at them go! I don't want to say spunk because that has other implications and definitions that just uh, don't apply. If they do, they might. And if they do, we have some serious problems. Like, what the fuck, Nork? You got some issues. What is this? Is it crank? Uh. There's gonna be a supercharge. Oh, there's gonna be a supercharge. There it is. Oh, hey, that's cool. I like the drawbridge. Cletus, how you doing? Been a long time. Maybe not. I don't actually remember you. Be on the lookout for no commando, Spyro. They better be on the lookout for me. Oh, shit! Spyro, you crazy. You a crazy bastard, Spyro. Honestly, sometimes you trash talk. It's on point. Sometimes it's cringy. Sometimes. <laughs> sometimes it's all right. Sometimes it's okay, Spyro. But most of the time it's not. So, you know. Probably just don't even take a chance. I, uh, really? Really, Bryson? Bryson, Bryson, old pal. Bryson, buddy, old pal. Just kill him. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I need, I need health already. Where's the other guy? Just die. Oh god. Okay, I got this room to myself. 
Got it all to myself, baby. How am I doing? 187. Could be better, but it's about to be fucking 207. So, hey, not bad. 207? 207. <laughs> I did math correctly. I know how to add 20. Look at me go. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Hey, noted. The guys, the, guy, the slightly taller guys can't ram those. Got it. All right. Where'd the game put me? Oh, good. Ram, flame, ram. Dodge ram him! Jesus Christ. I I still gotta remember that if if the going gets a little weird, what did I just get hit by? Okay, I'm already about to die again, which is, you know, just the best news. That's what I want to hear, honestly. Are there, are there rats down here? What the fuck did I just even say? What were those sounds? Excuse me. Oh my God, the big guys. The big guys have a fucking radius to them. Okay, that's fine. Honestly, I embrace this. This time I'll advance with the world's biggest amount of caution you've ever seen before. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> this is what caution looks like. God damn it. Oh fuck. Okay, you know what? Only go after the guys that... I nearly just killed myself. I nearly just killed myself. And you know what? I'm just glad I didn't. Okay, do your thing. Look at you go. And get up there. Fucking flame them. Making headway. Making headway. Hey, what up? <laughs> Making some headway. Oh my god. Oh god. Damn it. Ah! Damn it. I made it farther than I ever have. So everything's fine. Yeah, Sparks is gone. He's dead to me. I d it doesn't even matter. It's just now became like an NES game where you take a hit and you're dead. So that's that's fine. This is fine. This is fine. It's fine. What? It's, nothing's wrong. It's good. Ah, I love NES games. That's not even a, a lie. I grew up with the NES and then skipped to the GameCube. I had a weird video game upbringing, but my parents had an NES, so that's what the fuck I did. And I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Um, Spark. Oh yeah, he's dead. Um, <laughs> I was just about to ask for his advice on the situation. I cannot do that, however, on account of the fact that he is dead and I literally just got through talking about it. Oh, that's a gap that I nearly just ran through. Oh, the, the supercharge. Duh. Okay, this is fine. Everything's good. Take a shortcut. Well, well, shortcut to death and then I'll die on the water surface just like Jesus did. <laughs> what? All right, where the fuck's that supercharge thing? It's right here. Let me go up the supercharge ramp because typically there's stuff up here like an extra life for example and hey look at that 10 gems okay uh i did not put the drawbridge up so that's a little stupid of me there we go the drawbridge is up i see a guy up there waiting to get fucking rammed don't quote me on that but it's gonna be fucking awesome because god i fucking hate these fucking splatoon boys yo splatoon tim splat tim it's time for death Oh, hey, is this the end of it? Is this like the, the hidden treasury? Because if this is not the end of it, then I am going to be a little confused. This is definitely not the end of it. Sparks? Oh. Oh. Okay, I made it. It's fine. All right, Sparks. Oh, yeah, there's still that. Oh, yeah, I totally see what the fuck it wants. And it's not difficult. There was also an extra life up there. Okay, yeah, this is fine. It definitely wants me to just supercharge all the fucking way over there. Which, amongst all of the other supercharge um, puzzles, this one ranks one of the easier ones. So, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's cool. There it is. That's all the gems. Okay. I kind of want that extra life, though. Like, hi. Well... Nah, it's just the principle of the thing, you know? You know, you feel me? It's just the principle of the thing. Fuck it, I don't even, I don't even care. Look at me go, look at me go, look at me go. Oh, where was this, where was this, these tactics before? Can I just skip this? I'll tell you what, I'll skip right to fucking hell. What the fuck? Oh my God, it actually worked. It worked, go, just go. Spyro, just go. Just go, brother! You got it! You fucking dying! Oh god damn it! 
Oh my god, that's the se that's the second time. That extra life looking pretty good right about now. What the fuck with that guy? Who are you? Oh my god. Yes! Good fuck! Oh my god! Get me out of this world! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Just get, just go, just go, just go the fuck. <laughs> that was easy. It was fine. What? What are you guys even talking about? I didn't even struggle with that. Simple. Simple. Okay, yeah, I can start to see the fact that there could still- What? Oh my god, I could do this? I could do this? Yeah, there's- there's 12,000 gems in the game. There's only, like, 575 more. It's a little weird, because, like, sure, but whatever. How am I doing? Like, what's even the- Hey, how you doing, sweetie? Hi. Ah. Uh, oh! Oh. Is this the rest of the gems? That's it. Okay, in we fucking go, I guess. Your time is up, Gnasty Gnork! <laughs> oh, wait, actually Spyro's gotta go to Venus real quick. And he's back! Hey, Spyro, how was your trip to fucking outer space? The hell was that? What am I doing? Okay, I couldn't help but notice what the fuck was going on behind me. Um, don't like that. Don't like that one bit. Oh, was that him? Oh, it's Ganasty! Hey, Ganasty! Oh my god, dude, I've heard so much about you! Ganasty, what's up, brother? How, how's things? How's the wife? The kids? Hope they're fine. I'm just gonna go around collecting all your gems. I you're a thief. That's fucking weird. But okay, there's still- Yeah, there's 500 gems. I don't even need to know. I could just do the difference. What's- what's 1,000? What, 10,000, what, uh, 1,175 times 17, uh, uh, hello, 500, I know this. <laughs> Where am I going? Both in life and in the level. I don't know. We're about to find out. Oh, hey, hey, give me that key, give me that key, bitch. Give me that key. Hey, what are you gonna do if I come get that key off you? Probably a whole lot of nothing, bitch. Probably a whole lot of, where am I going? Where am I going? Oh, cut you off the mystic ruins, huh? 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 I'm out here! I will kill you! Do I actually have to do this? I mean, like, yes! Of course I have to do it. I feel like going the other way is faster. Okay. Oh, I could have definitely gotten him there. Okay, alright, alright. I'm seeing some Stratego. I'm seeing some Stratego. Lego Stratego. Um, for example, go right here. Oh, that's a wall. <laughs> alright! Hey! <laughs> Yeah! Give me the key, son of a bitch! Pretty sure that goes to this door! Get the key in the hole! Oh, God! Hey! That would have been amazing. Okay, sure. Guess we're doing this again. We're doing, doing, doing the old this. Just wanna make sure I'm not- Yeah! I don't wanna, like, miss some stuff. Like, I'll, I'll run this gauntlet, like, slowly once. To get all of the gems. And then I'll truly take on the fucking asshole. Did I get all of those? No, I didn't. Sparks, sparks, a silly guy, silly guy. You gotta, you gotta spread your wings and learn how to fly, my silly guy. Where am I going? Okay, he's over. <laughs> he was over there before he was raptured. Oh God, damn it, Sparks is dead. Well, that's fine. Who needs him? Just getting a fucking key, dude. I got it. I, I'm actually very surprised. <laughs> sure. Can I get Sparks back? Am I getting checkpoints every time that I unlock one of these doors? Cause like. I hope so. How you doing? Do I need to unlock this? Oh, he's pissed. That guy's fucking peeved. Is that it for this? Sparks is dead. I was just, I was trying to hit Sparks to know where the gems are at. But, uh, okay. Hey, how you doing, Ganasty? Ganasty Ganork? I don't know why I thought the final boss would be any different. Like, the bosses in Spyro have not been hard. In fact, they've been... I would say more levels than bosses, you know what I'm saying? Cause like, you get to a point, you flame them once. Big fucking deal, you know? Like, it's not, it's not, they're not difficult. They're more, they're more little gauntlets to run than they are, um, oh god, I gotta, gotta die, gotta blast into the stars to buy candy bars. Yeah, I'm, I'm losing my mind. Hey, silver linings. Guess who the fuck's back? It's Sparks. Why have you do that all again? Oh my god. I have a extreme distaste for this level. Let's get the fuck back to where we were. Hey! I was really trying to get him. But it didn't work. Where was- where, why did I die? Why did that happen again? I already forget. Like, I just misstepped or something. 
You know, I actually, I don't know this for a fact, but I think maybe you only need to get one of the key holders in the beginning. I went for both of them this time, but there's no reason to just, like, I'm pretty sure they're all just the same key, you know? Not one key goes to one specific thing. So, I think the only reason that a player would want to get both keys is because there's some gems hidden behind there, but there's not any more. So, I probably only need the first key holder. I don't know that for a fact, like I said. But, uh, that's my guess! I'm just, uh, just throwing up some guesses, because, uh, I think that's kind of fun. I like to theorize in Spyro the Dragon, it's just kind of what the fuck I do. Nork, are we doing this? God, you're such a little pansy. Nork, you're such a little pansy. You all so fucking are... God damn, you sane bolt! Why are you so fast? What is this? What? Is this the final boss of Spyro the Dragon? Is this the final boss of Spyro the Dragon? You sane bolt is the final boss of Spyro the Dragon? That's a, That came as a... You know what? Only a little bit of a shock. I'm a little shocked that this is Usain Bolt. We good? You pushed me. <laughs> you bastard, you pushed me a little. Oh, this is just slightly dangerous. Gnasty Gnork, you got the flaming Ganacho juice underneath us? I don't fucking like that at all, sir. I don't like that at all. What's that? It's not Ganacho juice, it's lava, and I just found that out firsthand because I'm a fucking idiot and I don't know how to jump. Cool. No! Fuck, game, really? It's not hard, it's just time consuming and tedious to do this over again. Wait, why did I just get, what? Did I really leave a single gem behind? You can dance if you wanna, you can leave a single gem behind. I just wanna state, I don't uh, consider nacho cheese nacho juice, but if we all come together as a community and instead refer to it as nacho juice, I think that'd be a lot funnier and the world would be slightly lighter. Now let me test this theory. I am very upset. Wait, why? Why? Fuck you, dude. Oh my God. This, okay. Let's get the fuck back to where we were over the nacho juice. Oh my God, I'm back to the nacho juice. I'm back to the nacho juice. Hey. Oh, I'm about to die at the nacho juice. Wait, what? You're not dead. You're not dead. You're toast, Nork. What? That was not the end of the- THAT WAS NOT THE END OF THE GAME, RIGHT? Is that the end of the game? <laughs> uh... Sorry I took so long. Almost forgot about you guys. What about Ganasty Ganork? Hey, Ganasty Bob! Nork is toast. So, now there's order again in the Dragon Kingdom? Well, mostly. I've still got some treasure to find. What will you do next? I'd say the sky's the limit. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Spyro got a trilogy. That was charming. I like that. I like that a lot. Um, I have not stated anything about this yet. But I'm gonna state it here. Throughout this let's play, there have been maybe twice, maybe two times, where I just got super stuck and I looked something up. And when I did, I seen gameplay footage of the Reignited trilogy, and it did not look like what I was playing. <laughs> the Switch is an incredible console. The fact that it could even run this at all the way it does is fantastic. It is amazing. And honestly, that's probably my preferred way to play it is in bed in handheld. But in the terms of a let's play, had I known how not as good this game looks as like the PS4 version, I would have probably just elected to instead do the PS4 version. I don't have it, but I think, and here's the thing, is you guys enjoyed this, I enjoyed this, we're gonna do Spyro 2 eventually down the road for sure. I think between now and then I will pick up the PS4 version and instead I will cover this game series, the rest of the trilogy on the PS4 version because it looks a lot better. Like a lot better. And that's not to, that's not to discredit this. I want to state that had I been playing this for myself, I don't really care about quality. I'd rather lay in my bed and play this on like a Game Boy Advance kind of deal in handheld mode. That's fucking rad. But in the purpose of recording it, I think 
the quality should be as high as it could be. And this game is not that cheap or not that expensive anymore. So maybe by then I'll probably pick it up. Also, these are cute images. That being said, this game really good. Like if this, if this, if this game series was as good as this trilogy remake was in the beginning, like, God damn, it's good. And I can't judge that. You guys have told me that it's very similar. Like, it's very... There's only a few key differences. And for some of the differences between the, the trilogy and the original, a lot of you guys actually prefer the original, which is really wild. That must mean that the original game was fantastic. Maybe in the future, I'll kind of one-off the the original Spyro the Dragon. Uh, just, just out of sheer curiosity. Um... It wouldn't really fall under a bonus episode, it would be more of a one-off, and I'd probably just dick around in some of the first worlds in Artisan. Um, but that sounds, that sounds kind of interesting. I'd emulate it too, because I don't know, what is this even for? PS2? PS... Is it PS2? The PS1? Is it PS1? It might be PS1, I have no idea. <laughs> that's, that's how, that's how out of touch I am with the Spyro the Dragon series. Um, but I've not really seen many things from the original. I seen a single image that I was sent over the Discord server, and wow, it looks not bad. First off, I should say it doesn't look bad, but it looks worse than this by a long shot, which is obvious. Fucking duh. This game is obviously prettier because, you know, it's a goddamn remake. So, of course, it looks prettier. I, uh, I thoroughly enjoyed this, though, and I could see that, uh, like, anybody that grew up with Spyro the Dragon, it's like their childhood game. Of course, they're gonna find this game, you know, incredibly charming. And as somebody that does not have the nostalgia goggles on, it is incredibly charming. It's a really good game. Um, so, I mean, if, you, if you've ever wondered, you know, I really like Spyro the Dragon, but it's probably just because I played it when I was seven. Somebody that's only playing it when they're 23, 24, 20, how old am I? I think I'm 23. <laughs> I'm 23. Somebody playing it for the first time in their life when they're 23 years old. This game was fucking great. Like, this was really good. This was really fun to play. So, yeah, we will definitely be covering Spyro the Dragon 2. Uh, now, typically, here's the thing. Typically, uh, the next Let's Play would be decided by the patrons. Uh, there would be, it would be left up to a poll. And actually, the patrons just decided on something that's going to actually start airing relatively soon. I haven't even recorded the first episode, but, uh, the poll numbers are in, folks. Uh, and I know what I'm going to be covering next on the channel. But the thing that the poll was for is actually an accompanying Let's Play to Okami. So there's going to be two v uploads a day, and then one, then two, then one. We kind of did that in the past, and we're going to resume doing that for the foreseeable. Um, just to kind of accompany Okami. Um, but the thing that's uh, actually replacing this is going to be a little different um, than that. I'm not actually going to leave that to a poll, because it's something that everybody wants to see. And... I'm just gonna say it because we've been away from the series for maybe a month. We're going back to Kingdom Hearts already. I am actually going to be jumping into Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. Is that what the fuck is called? I don't know. <laughs> for the PS4 collection that I was playing the original Kingdom Hearts on. Um, now, as far as I know, it's probably best that if you don't know about Kingdom Hearts, you watch the Kingdom Hearts 1 Let's Play or you play Kingdom Hearts 1 yourself before jumping into that. Um, but I did a pretty good Let's Play of Kingdom Hearts 1. Um, a lot of people seem to enjoy it, so I hope that all those people will make a return and seem to enjoy Chain of Memories, unless I am much worse at that than Kingdom Hearts 1. Oh, man, that seems seems like I'd be a little hard-pressed to make that happen. <laughs> I was not the best at Kingdom Hearts 1. Um, but that's okay. Nobody, nobody cares. Really? I mean, some people cared, and then they said some nasty, good nasty things, and then they left, which is fine. That's kind of the nature of the YouTube beast, but whatever. Um, yeah, but that that's what's coming up next. Uh, so not tomorrow, because tomorrow's an episode of Okami, but the next day. And then there will be a Let's Play also starting soon that's accompanying Okami that I can't mention. The patrons know, so that's kind of cool. Um, if you guys want to consider supporting me on Patreon, you guys will actually... 
um, be able to do that and uh, vote on Let's Plays that will happen on the channel in the future. So that's kind of cool. And in turn, I guess the patrons also understand what the next Let's Play is before anybody else. Because I'm not going to announce what the patrons voted on. Only the patrons know the results of that poll. And that's kind of cool. Um, that's going to be coming out soon. That's also another blind Let's Play. That's all I'll say about that. Um, it's going to be interesting. It's going to be very interesting. But, uh, yeah, Spyro the Dragon, very cool. Something I always really liked about Spyro was his design. I always thought the purple on yellow was really cool. Um, I always thought the, 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 like, there are some video game characters out there that, from a design standpoint alone, I genuinely get a kick out of. The main one, like, really fucking love the design, Sonic the Hedgehog. I've always really liked the Sonic the Hedgehog's design. Spyro the Dragon is definitely one of those, like, eye candy kind of, like, I can't, that's weird, that's like sexualized, isn't it? That's a sexualized saying. Mmm, damn Spyro looking good in that fucking cake, bro. <laughs> I, it, like, appealing to look at characters. Uh, the design of Spyro is really good. Um, I've always, oh god, the screen dimmed, sorry. I just haven't touched the controller in a long time. I really, I really, really like the design of Spyro and a lot of the other characters in this were good too. Some of the enemy designs were so fucking charming and just cute. Um, I wouldn't even classify Spyro as like a cute design. Um, I would classify him more as a cool design. I mean, I guess how some pe I could see how some people could find Spyro like cute, but nah, Spyro's, Spyro's fucking cool, dude. Seems like the kind of guy that would go to fucking get fucking ganacho juice at the ball game with you. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Sorry. I don't even know what I'm on about. I was not expecting when I was going to sit down today and record this that this would be the finale. I really didn't. Um, you guys told me two episodes ago that we would have, would have two to three episodes left. Um, so that's a little weird that this is the finale because I was like, okay, I'm going to venture that it's probably going to be more three. But I see now why. I mean, Nasty Nork World took no time at all. Like, there were two levels in it, and then it's like, time to fight the boss, and okay. Like, everything in the final world was not even spread out. I had to find the gems, and they were like, okay, what happens if you need 400 gems all in this fucking tiny confined area? And the answer was, you get them in like five seconds. Some of them were locked off till you unlock the final world, but you know, or the final level anyway. Um, yeah, goddamn, Sparrow was really good. I genuinely, genuinely enjoyed myself. So that's cool. I, uh, I knew I would like this series. I always knew that I would get a kick out of Spyro. I'm not, I feel like I've said this in the past, but I played a fraction of an hour's worth. I don't know, like less than an hour's worth of the GBA game Spyro Fire and Ice, I think it was called. Um, because my friend had it, and I was like, I'm gonna try the shit out of this. And then I tried the shit out of it, and I liked it, and then I just stopped playing it because my friend had a lot of GBA games, so I just wanted to try them all. Um, and that was, that was part of the, the fucking GBA roulette of the day. Um, so yeah, that's all I played, and I guess that's probably very obviously not a good indicator of the Spyro the Dragon series, because, I mean, it's a GBA game. The formula of Spyro the Dragon wouldn't translate as well for a game console that was that, you know, low quality. That's not what I want to say. The GBA was fucking incredible and I grew up with that. You know what I mean though. I mean, literally the quality is lower of than, than that of the PS1 or 2 or whatever the fuck. It, it was definitely PS1, right? Because the models were so polygonal that I seen within that picture. I don't know. I don't know. Also, these are fucking long credits. Running out of things to talk about. I don't even know. Rob, Rob Schoenfeld. Yeah, I said your name. Hey, thank you for your work on Spyro the Dragon. I really enjoyed it. I'm kind of hoping that there's going to be a post-credits cutscene, but uh, I guess we'll see. Global it! <laughs> Not the fuck what that job title is actually called, but okay. I might actually, uh, might actually just let the credits play here and uh, chime back in when they're done. I think that's what I'm gonna do, because these credits are fucking long and not ending. So I'll see you guys at the end of the credits if there is a thing. And if not, then I'll still say bye. <laughs> so get excited if you like hearing me say goodbye.
Oh my god, is it done? <laughs> the screen actually dimmed that part of that. <laughs> oh, whoops, the adventure continues. That's where you're wrong, pal. We're done. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What do you, th what do you even think you're talking about right now? <laughs> god damn, those credits were long. And it was the same song the entire time. The oh, it's doing the fucking Zelda thing. No. No. One of two dragons, my dick. I am not doing this. Okay, well, there is no post credit thing. It was just uh, taking me back here, doing the before the boss thing for some reason. Anyway, okay, that's gonna be it for this Let's Play. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this episode, please give it a like. If you guys wanna subscribe to follow the remainder of the projects I have planned for the channel, please do so. If you guys see a moment you'd like to take for a best of compilation that comes up at the end of this month, go down to the description below to see how to do just that. And consider supporting me on Patreon. You bastard! Cover your fucking face when you sneeze, Spyro. Especially in this climate. Yikes. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. Come back next time for another Let's Play here on the channel.